think it's time to do a haul because this is getting out of hand. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Jay Fong here and today I have a haul for you. Things have been piling up at the corner of my room. I am not ready to bust them out just yet because I have been shopping for fall and winter. I don't know about you guys, but I tend to love shopping for fall and winter. I don't know, there's just something about buying like jackets and coats and boots that I enjoy a lot more compared to shopping for spring and summer. So I tend to start shopping for my fall and winter needs super super early on. So today um, I have a couple of things to show you guys that I am preparing to wear for fall and winter. This is by no means like things that I can wear today but I am excited nonetheless. So let's start with the Nordstrom anniversary sale. I know that ended a couple weeks ago, but I picked up some stuff, they all came. I typically don't do like crazy amount of shopping like most people here on YouTube do like with their crazy Nordstrom anniversary sales. Um, every now and then though, I will see a couple of things that I would like um, and I have a few things to show you from that sale. Starting from the sweater that I have on, I actually picked it up in two different colors. Um, I realized that I don't really have these like thinner cardigans. I tend to have just like thicker cardigans or sweaters, but nothing kind of like this thinner one, which it's such a basic, I can't believe I don't have, but I picked up two. So this nice tan color that I have on right now, it's super, super soft. And let me tell you, this past week in LA has been really weird. It's actually gotten a little bit cold. So I'm excited that I finally get to wear long sleeves. Again, like I told you, I am a sucker for fall and winter stuff. So anytime I get to like bust out a long sleeve, I'm super happy. So I have this tan color one. I also got this in a dusty pink. It is this slightly cropped, definitely oversized type of cardigan, but I think it's great. You can just throw it over like a long sleeve, a short sleeve or something like that um, as a jacket, but you can also just wear it on its own like I am today um, as, a, as a top when it gets a little bit chilly. So these two are from Halogen. Um, I will try to link anything that's still available. Anything that were from the Nordstrom anniversary sale, you can definitely still buy today just without the sale discount. <laughs> um, so I got this for $34.90 and it is so soft. My husband always laughs at me for buying things because they're soft, but I swear, like if I can just shop with my eyes closed and by feel, my whole entire closet will probably be just like clouds but this is super, super soft, so I'm excited to wear these. All right, the next thing I know, again, like I told you guys, I am shopping for fall and winter, but I got this nice coat. This coat you can um, reverse in and out, so it's like a reversible coat. So on one side, it's this dark gray color with big pockets on the side, and then on the other side, it's this sort of like dark, blue, dark gray. I think there's like three different colors mixed into it. This sort of plaid pattern. So I'm, I'm actually super excited about it. I don't have a lot of reversible coats. I actually think this might be my first like truly coats that you can reverse. Um, so I'm still trying to figure out how I feel about this whether or not I want to keep it, um, but it is oversized. I bought it to be oversized so I can layer on top of other things. I typically like these like double face coats because I feel like they tend to keep warmth in um, versus like a lined coat. It makes a lot of noise and I don't know. I tend to like these because they are like light enough but also warm. And this one is from the brand Bernardo. I've never purchased anything from them. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to, to try this baby out. Last thing I picked up from the anniversary sale is a pair of Sam Edelman boots. I've been eyeing these boots for a while and guys, I haven't purchased from Sam Edelman in a while. Their box is like totally elevated. Oh my gosh. Um, it used to be this like black top green box. Now it's in this like really nice feeling like green box. I'm gonna put that there. Definitely feel like Sam Edelman is stepping up their game. So I got a pair of combat boots. I remember loving, 
loving combat boots like in my college years. I used to have a pair that I wore every single day in college, like literally almost every single day when I was in college and I, I loved it to death. I just love the look of it. I used to wear it with like a pair of leggings and like an oversized either like hoodie or sweater and that would be my college get up. Um, you know, when you're rolling into class at like 8 a.m., nobody wants to look cute and I feel like combat boots just kind of kind of dresses everything up a little bit but these are a pair of Sam Edelman's that I've been eyeing there is also another pair where um, the stretchy part of it covers most part of the boot but this is um, a part of the anniversary sale so I picked these up I'm excited to wear these I've tried these on um, once before and they're pretty true to size so I just bought my regular size 8 I will definitely try these on for you guys and I'll let you guys know how it wears but the leather is actually surprisingly soft um, it does smell just a little bit of that like new factory scent um, that I'm hoping it will go away because it is pretty strong but I am excited for these I feel like you can do no wrong with combat boots I love my booties I have booties in all shape and sizes um all in black and to my husband they all look the same but i swear they all do its function and i'm excited to add a pair of combat boots back in my collection because i haven't actually wore combat boots in a really long time so that is everything from the nordstrom anniversary sale but let's keep the train going i have a skirt here by top shop and let me tell you guys i am pretty much like 99.9% .9 always in jeans type of girl. No matter the season, no matter the weather, I am pretty much always in jeans. I don't have skirts in my collection. I don't have shorts. I don't have a single pair of shorts, which is pretty surprising. I, I think the last time I wore a pair of shorts was in like college. So I don't, I really don't have anything like that. I don't really have many dresses that I wear unless it's on specific occasions or I want like to accomplish a certain look. But lately, I don't know what's come over me, but I have been wanting to add skirts to my collection. I just feel like they look so cute. They can, you know, add an extra flair that looks slightly different. But anyway, I have been trying to change things up, as you can tell, in my collection. Um, I have been wanting a pair of denim skirt. I didn't want a pair that was, like, too, too short. I didn't want one that was too long. I don't know. I was just looking, searching high and low. Um, and I saw this. This is a pair of Topshop. Um, pretty standard denim skirt in a black and I actually um, have already worn this once and I loved it so much that I'm considering getting the light blue version but I just thought it was really cute it has a stretchy back which is always nice um, and so with a stretchy back you can either like size down if you wanted to I was in between sizes so I actually went up a size now I kind of wish I actually did size down but that's okay um, they are really really comfortable the denim material is actually quite soft it has this like slight washed look and feel to it so I love it it's it's just really really cute it's almost like it's not yet a line but just slightly flares out just a little bit um, to give you just a little bit more shape <laughs> around that area. This is my first pair of denim skirt in like who knows how long. <laughs> All right, let's continue the dark denim train. So I have a also sort of this like acid wash black denim jacket that I got from Bash and I absolutely have been loving the brand. I'm fairly new to the brand. I have intro another jacket that I have from them. It was a trench coat in my, I think it was like top five outer wear and I featured one of their trench coats there and I have been loving the brand ever since. I think the brand is like the perfect brand if you want to dress Parisian. You can either go like Parisian chic with you know like their more classic items or very like bohemian Parisian with their like dresses. There's a lot of paisley print. There's a lot of I don't know really cool prints. Anyway I have been really really into just like looking up the brand following their social media just to see what they wear and what they put out and when I saw this on their website I absolutely fell in love with how it looked on the model. Um, it is just a pretty standard denim jacket but the cool thing is um, it actually kind of wraps it. So it's like a coat um, that you can just tie up at the waist which 
really really helps cinch in the waist it really gives you that nice little a-line for me it's kind of hard to find coats um, or shirts actually where it ties around the waist because I feel like I have a longer torso and so depending on how Depending on how it's made, it either makes my legs look really short or I just feel like my a part of my body is just cut off the weird way. But I love this one because you can wear this, you know, over just anything, kind of like a jacket, but you can wear it alone too as a top. And I feel like it looks really, really nice as a top. It sort of has this like slightly bigger arm um, that just makes the jacket look super cool and then again it like cinches in the waist so it just really gives you that feminine feel and look to a really really otherwise cold jacket and the model on the website had actually paired it with a midi skirt so I bought a midi skirt. This is a really cool kind of midi skirt. It has this like from afar it almost could pass as maybe like a paint splatter or like a leopard print because of how the colors are coordinated um but yeah i i tried it on and honestly this looks so good even without the jacket but i had to get the two of them together because the model just made it look so good this is this is what marketing 101 is for is like make them look good enough together and separate um, on a model that you'll want to buy both to complete the outfit <laughs> um so it's pretty, it's a pretty standard skirt. It has a couple of like small details um, around the skirt that I feel like just, I don't know, makes the skirt look so flattering. When I tried it on in store, like, and again, it's probably sales associate doing their thing, but they're like, oh my gosh, it looks so good on you. And then you're kind of like, yeah, I think it does. <laughs> so, um, yeah, again, I don't have really have anything like this. So I am trying to add just, you know, like, skirts or things here and there to my collection and I'm I'm pretty pretty excited for this skirt I feel like it's a great kind of like classics that won't go out of style because you know it's in black and white so I feel like it's kind of hard to go out of style um, it's in kind of an inconspicuous print where you don't know what it is it's great for fall and winter and even in like the spring and summertime if you want to bust it out because you know you you like me don't wear color I, I feel like this is great it's sort of cut in like a tiered skirt where there's different like stitching there to make it slightly like a tiered skirt but I feel like it's so inconspicuous that you can't really tell but it definitely helps mix this skirt like a little bit fuller at the bottom so you're not completely just like straight up and down um, and I love this chiffon material it's really nice really soft and just it's like super airy when you have it on okay continue on this skirt thing that I have going on I have this champagne gold color pleated skirt from H&M I have been wanting to add a pleated like midi skirt in my collection for a while and um, this was kind of just like the right length it was the right sort of material I love these like really really hard pressed pleats in there um, I just I just like the look of it on other people um, I haven't had a chance to wear them I've, I've bought this for like forever now I just haven't had a chance to actually wear this yet so I don't know I don't know if this is gonna be a purchase that I I know I want but will never wear or maybe eventually I'll, I'll get good wear out of them but I thought it would look good in the summertime because it's light enough where I think with like a white t-shirt or a white top at the top it'll look really cute and then it could be just like a great holiday skirt <laughs> okay and we're down to the last thing it is a cardigan by Sandro and I, I I'm so 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 excited to wear this this is a definitely like a heavy cardigan um, I believe they call it like a codigan because it has like a little bit of wool it's in this like houndstooth pattern but woven like tweed if you know anything about me you know that I, I love tweed prints I love tweed in any color love tweed I also love denim, I also love mixed patterns, and I also love mixed materials. And this codigan checks off every single one of those boxes. It is, I, it just looks so cool. Um, I just imagine that I'll be wearing this every day. Every day during the winter time. I mean, probably not every day, but every day, seriously. Um, I'm so excited about this. I actually had totally missed out on this like tweed denim coat from 
I believe it might have been the 2019 Sandro season. I, I had saw it, I've seen it on a couple of different maybe like social media posts or whatever and when I have like gone in and like wanting to purchase it was already all sold out. I was really really bummed about it and this came on the radar and I knew I had to pick it up. I have been loving Sandro and Mage, Maj, Mage, Maji lately. <laughs> um, they're both Parisian brands, um, they're both Parisian brands by two Parisian sisters um, and I've been like reading up on, on that like whole story for a while but anyway I feel like they make clothes that's like right up my alley they have a lot of kind of like preppy chic preppy Parisian chic maybe it's like if a like Upper East Side meets old grandma <laughs> if that makes any sense I don't know why I feel like tweed is such like an like synonymous with older grandma like a lot of older grandmas wear tweed um but i love it and i feel like sandra and maj has just somehow made it kind of cooler and it's almost like if i don't know serena vander woodson from um, gossip girl raided like blair's wardrobe and then like made it cooler like that's how i would kind of define sandra and mage it's like they've made that preppy really really preppy outfit cool I don't know I'm talking myself <laughs> into just like this weird hole but anyway I'm really really excited for this I, I loved a lot of things from Sandra at Maj lately and I'm totally planning on adding more to the collection and um, I, I just love the denim and, and this sort of like tweed look so excited for the fall and winter time <laughs> and that is it thank you so much for watching Please let me know in the comment section below which are the pieces that you guys like, if you guys picked up anything from the Nordstrom anniversary sale, and how many of you guys are actually excited by the fall and winter weather because I'm so excited. I know I got a glimpse of cooler weather this week and I am just so excited to finally be able to bust out some of my sweaters and my jackets and my coats and just layer up and bundle up for the fall and winter time. That is it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!